Hello everyone, so now I'm ready for a special birthday party. Let's go. That's right, I've come to celebrate the 100th anniversary of the founding of the Communist Party of China. So, the CPC was founded 100 years ago on July 1st. To be precise, the CPC held its first National Congress on July 23, 1921, and the anniversary of the founding of the party was set on July 1st. So, how is the CPC doing now? Today, the party has over 95 million CPC members, but do you know that when it was founded, it had only a little over 50 members. From 50 to about 95 million? That's a lot. It's okay, you know, it's about 10 million more than the population of Germany. By the way, I hear that the first CPC Congress was held in quite an unusual place. That's right. One of the venues of the first National Congress of the CPC was actually a boat. So if someone talks about Red Bull Spirit, they're referring to this boat in Jiaxing. Red Bull Spirit highlights pioneering work, resistance and dedication. It's seen as the impetus for the party to strive for development and growth. What's more interesting is that if you look at today's ceremony in Tiananmen Square from above, you will see that the audience area is presented in the shape of a giant ship. Over the past 100 years, the tiny boat of the CPC has evolved into a giant ship, which carries the hope of the people and the Chinese nation. The party has led China to achieve amazing development. So, why has the CPC done so well? And how? The answer is right in front of you. The secret of the CPC's success can be found at today's celebrations. It's the people. The party believes the state is the people, and the people are the state. For a hundred years, the CPC has always put people first. The CPC's original aspiration and mission is to seek happiness for the Chinese people and rejuvenation for the Chinese nation. And public support is the key to the CPC's strength and confidence in long-term governance. Chinese people have seen tremendous advances in their lives under the CPC's leadership. That's why we say today's celebration isn't only for the Communist Party of China, but also for the 1.4 billion Chinese people. <laughs>